of Tennessee is giving students the chance to do some hands on learning and it's all thanks to new research that is being built and new buildings going up. Our John Pierceos was at the groundbreaking ceremony today and tells us why this space is already attracting some pretty big companies. Work is underway to bring a new building to the University of Tennessee Research Park. It's called the Innovation South, and it'll be the fourth building in the park. In this new building, it is going to change industries and create economic opportunity across the region. Thursday marked the groundbreaking ceremony for the 84,000 square foot building. The university will run classes and research out of half the building. The other half will be leased to companies. That space is already sold out. It's a perfect example of what we call a public-private partnership. And more and more of those are developing here at the university. The point of the partnership is to have students learn from professionals since they'll be sharing the space. When you were in school and I was in school, it wasn't always easy to have real world hands on experience. That's one of the things that UT really excels in. President of the UT Research Park, Tom Rogers, says it'll mostly be biotech and manufacturing companies to use the space. Volkswagen Group of America will be researching there too. Roger says UT students will be studying topics to help those companies. Composites research, making materials that are lighter weight, and stronger, and that's of great interest to automotive companies, to manufacturing companies, to aerospace companies. Construction of the Innovation South building is underway and is expected to open in the fall of 2024. In Knoxville, John Piersos, WVLT News. Roger says that there will be about 50 graduate students, about 100 undergrads who are studying there once that building opens.